everyone, this is your girl Soli Sims and welcome back to another episode of Stranded in Sulani, Rags to Riches. In our last episode, we were talking about how Nalani was feeling really depressed because she had lost uh, one of her sons from her recent pregnancy, the babysitter who was a cousin of hers, a distant cousin through adoption, who came over to help raise the children, the toddlers that she had, the triplets, before, and she's welcomed her into the family. They were all a big happy family, so much so that they felt that they needed to expand the house to include a room not just for um, the triplets and the, and Jesse and Nalani, but Ayaka as well because they felt that she was part of the family. She's been doing such a great job in taking care of the kids. They built a specific um, bed for her, um, a room for her, sorry, and the babies that Nalani was pregnant with because she had twin boys. Um, she came home from the hospital and Gianni was there but unfortunately after a nap waking up Ayaka was gone and so was Zane and Nalani was just devastated over it she could not believe it she has been feeling really down but she's determined to try to track down not just Ayaka but Zane as well baby Zane as well so um, right now we're just doing uh, just a few of her mini goals. She wants to um, find some things while beach combing as well as do a grill barbecue or, or, or roast food. Um, we don't have a grill as yet. We don't have um, much in the way of furniture, etc. as yet. Simply because... Oh, who is this? Oh, and she's pregnant. Okay, I have no idea who that person is. But they're in our house and I think too that we need to start locking our doors. This is the front door definitely. Um, but we do need to start locking our doors for only family members. Everyone but household members. And we're going to do this for all the doors because I've noticed that um, locked off people will just randomly come in. I mean just randomly come into our house. We can't have that. Now, guys, um, oh, no, I meant it that it's locked for everyone. I'm really curious to know, and I mean, I will look it up as well, but I'm hoping that I find a solution to this. But in the event that you have sims that you invite over to your house, even if you have it where you, um, you lock the door for everyone but household members, does that mean that when you have the sims that you've invited over, they won't be able to um, just come into the house or something. So I'm really curious to know what's the uh, case with that, if that's something that you can, you can do. Um, so Jesse, now we, we do want to try to get some of his goals um, set and over with. He wants to marry, get married to his best friend. So we're going to work on their relationship, Jesse and Nelani's, just to bring it up to where it's supposed to be. The triplets are doing pretty okay, and baby Gianni is here next to his dad. Let's see, what, what is she doing? She's out swimming again. I do want her, let's see, what's what's with this? You haven't found anything beachcombing? Go ahead and beachcomb for some more stuff. I would love to be able to take the kids out for maybe like a picnic. I was thinking of that, doing like a picnic. I think that would be nice for them. What's this? Or relaxing swim. I saw this like the swimming pool, and I thought maybe she went to a swimming pool somewhere. I was wondering what is going on. <laughs> so wet. Oh, that's so cool that it recognizes that all this is paved in, so it's not recognizing it as as a um as sand so yes so this is what it is jesse is working well he, he's working on something right now um for his freelance freelancer career he has to write a book etc is due on thursday not thursday on wednesday i'm also thinking guys let me just have him use the washroom before he does anything else i was also thinking guys that maybe i could have um 
the toddlers age up when they all get to at least level three in all their skills and we do have some of them and i will just go through i think the only thing that the, the toddlers are struggling with right now in terms of um skill is the potty everything else is pretty much okay so as soon as i think potty goes up to three for all of them yeah it should be great it should be fine to age them up to children i i, I think it will work out um pretty good overall if, if we do it like that instead of doing the whole um the whole level five thing <laughs> i'm kind of I'm, I'm kind of ready for them to be just a little bit older you know so yes so everybody is excited and happy i i feel a little bit disappointed um that ayaka left because i really kind of wanted her to continue to do the things that she was doing with the household so it was it's really disappointing to me that um that she left unfortunately i do want to get her to do some figure um paintings as well i th I, th I think they're very very nice what she does okay so everybody is mm, up to, what's, what's this is this still in good okay it's still five hours before it spoils I'm going to go ahead and drag it. I don't. It's not something that I usually do, but I'm going to go ahead and drag it into her just to help them out a bit, and just speed this up to have it be just a little bit better. Um, there is cleaning up to do, so I think before she can even go ahead and paint, etc., she does need to take care of the children. I think. Um, why not why not why not spend time with the children the P fox of park avenue go ahead yes you can write that um i think she can probably spend time with the children so she is going going to teach shapes to um little matthew and kalani um mm, what can i have her do toddler care no i think one of the kids do need to go to the to have a shower you know i just can't remember who alicia is asleep i think it was alicia who needed um to go to the sh to have a bath but what i'm going to do i'm going to have her give a bubble bath to the baby not the baby to kalani and then she can go and do other stuff so guys i can't believe that i actually almost forgot to mention this to you so i asked in a previous video as well as on twitter i put up a poll asking what is the recommended settings for the goal being accomplished for being rags to riches now i had a price uh, range from a hundred thousand two hundred and fifty thousand and um 150 to 200 200 to 250 of to 350 sorry and more and it was a close call between 100 and 150 as well as um uh, more but for me i felt that to me i felt that um personally my goal would have been um like 150 to 200 that's inclusive of course of the household as well as the funds that the household has i feel that would be good as a combination so i'm thinking because we're already so close oh jesse's done he's taking a break or he's done are you done i think he's just taking a break okay well if, if that's the case in that case um maybe he can have teach kalani potty train kalani that will help to bring up the what are you angry about <laughs> don't complain your toys okay so yeah so she's going to do the whole potty thing and then i think jesse can probably give her a bath after i think that works fine so okay so i was saying guys my 
um, filling on it is like a, a good range of 150 to 200 um, to 200,000 is a good range for um, being moving from rags to riches and um, yeah I think I think that's pretty good and we're already at about fifty thousand dollars so we just have to th I think um, just finish uh, putting together things in this house and I think it's going to bring us pretty close to our goal of um, what it is that we want at a hundred um, two hundred thousand what is she doing she's supposed to be oh and she wants to okay um, you know what well in the meantime you can have you can give your son a bath give Matthew a, a quick bath oh my gosh the baby's screaming 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 okay so maybe she needs to feed him first so she's going to bottle feed um, Gianni make a silly face and just rock for a bit and then do the um, give the child the bath that's what I think I think that's a good idea for her to give Matthew a bath after there was an option for her she wanted, really wanted to try to have another baby but Jesse says that he thinks it's just a little bit too soon um, and he also th thought that maybe she was just missing Zane a little bit too much which is why she wanted to do this that that's my um, my thoughts on the matter so we don't know we don't know that's that's what he said to her so she she had to um, forget about that <laughs> that's not something that that sh she really needs to to focus on right now and we do want to try to make a little bit more money so there's that as well um, but they do feel the strain they didn't realize how much they were really dependent on um, a yaka to help with raising the kids etc until then just then when um, they realize how much um, effort it takes it, into raising the children to make sure that everything is okay Oh, Jesse is giving him a bath so she doesn't have to so she can just go and sleep after no 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 no. before you go and sleep I think you should go um, is your your bladder situation and then go and sleep tomorrow I kind of want her to work on doing some paintings because we do need some monies um, I think that's very important uh, so yeah so he's going to oh they just became good friends Gianni I wonder if he's going to be a little a little mermaid as well oh well she needs to change him because he's going to come we coming to you um, Ayaka says um, she has an extra ticket to the hottest opera in town I want her to go up and meet up with Ayaka because um, I think that would be good for the storyline so she wants to confront her and see what happens with that whole situation. She really, really wants to know what's going on with, with Ayaka and her child. So they have to make, schedule a meet sometime soon. Okay, so I've sent her to sleep. Let me just... Jesse just needs to clean out so much. Do I even have a, 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 an outside bin? I'm not sure. Not, no, 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 no. Before you do any of these things, um, give Kalani a bath. She needs a bath as well. And there's so much that needs repairing. Did he clean out the lint? Yes, he did. I want him to clean up hair as well and take out the trash. I'm not sure that we actually do have an outdoor bin. I can't remember that we, that we took one. So he's just cleaning up the kids just before bed. Nalani is really really tired. I mean she's had a long day both she and the, the baby They're both asleep, which is so sweet. It's really really sweet. I can't wait to see what the um, kids themselves get up to um, And everything how they're going to be as <laughs> let's, go, let's go see what's that I thought you could walk now little guy That's your little brother how do you feel about him? I'm curious. I know that Alicia was really, really upset. She was really not feeling the whole little brother business. And I think she, she spoke to her mom about it. Um, mom tried to reassure her, etc. She's still feeling just a little bit um, 
of a grudge against having a, a baby brother that she didn't really want considering um she's she already believes that she doesn't have enough time with her parents as it is um so yeah so she was really really upset about it it's almost gianni's birthday i know it's almost his birthday but i also want oh my gosh um i want the kids would they show it in her we have so much coming up soon though guys it's monday now on tuesday it's harvest fest um again wasn't it harvest fest just recently um on wednesday it's meet a celebrity thursday it is winter fest is pretty soon wow oh i only have like the day set for 14 and then there's a, there's nothing really that um I didn't set any new any new events in the calendar any new holidays in the calendar but um, maybe as the kids get older it's something that I can start to implement I think it would be good overall oh he's there making a mess okay so he's gotten to a level two handiness the toilet still isn't fixed I thought the toilet would have been fixed by now because I don't want him to have give Kalani a bath and um get back to working on his stuff it's already almost 10 at night he has so much for him to do and like i said guys they're really feeling the loss not just of a trusted friend but of the baby as well which is really sad i should get rid of this but um yeah we will see how it how it goes i don't want um nalani <laughs> getting pregnant again i don't want another baby but i'm not in control of this this is what it is i'm going to let them um do it however best they feel that they should do it so if they woohoo and she gets pregnant again it's not on me i'm not going to go ahead and try for a baby but if it happens it happens <laughs> it's going that's going to be so interesting if it happens it happens okay so um there are some things that he can possibly quite possibly get i think um i'm going to have him give the child a bath instead of doing any of these things i do want to um scavenge for parts and uh and then throw everything away i think that would be good i think that would be good and then he can empty the trash so guys i'm going to go ahead and leave off this episode here as you can see we didn't get too much done in the way of any big accomplishments but you do have a little bit more of an idea of, of where the story is going and what has been happening um, and what the goals are finally <laughs> for um, the next couple of episodes we're working towards 150 to 200 thousand dollars overall whilst we're cultivating this whole new family and seeing where everybody goes and how everybody leads off so guys, I will see you again in the very next video. Don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, do not forget to subscribe if you haven't as yet. And I will see you again guys. Goodbye.